Hi, I'm Raf, and in this video, we'll be solving the set options home domain quest from level two. In this quest, you're going to have to add a home domain to your quest account. To do that, we're going to generate a TomL file, and this TomL file is going to allow you to publish as much information about your company as you'd like. This is important on Stellar because we can have multiple different assets of the same name just issued by different people. So if you issue your as much inf uh, as much information as possible about your token, it allows people to trust you. There's lots of different information that you can attach into a Tom L, and um, and that's published in SEP one. There's a link to it at the bottom of the Stellar Quest page. Highly suggest you check it out. For now, Stellar Quest has been nice enough to give you a link and that creates a template for the Atom L file. So this is the link here. So let's go fund our key pair for this quest. Let's copy over our public key. And let's copy over our secret key. Now go ahead and click on this template creator. I've already done that and I have it open. So the first thing it's going to ask you to do is to insert your quest key pair into this Tom L. So let's copy our public key and paste it in. There you go. The next thing that we're supposed to do is change the project domain name. So let's go into settings, edit our project details, and then set a project name. Um, doesn't matter what it is. Okay, doesn't matter. It's a description. I'm just saving this up. Okay, and then now it's asking us to click on preview and then preview in a new window. This link here is the link that we're going to attach to our account. So let's head back into our lab. Our source account that's going to be attached to this domain name is our Stellar Quest public key. Let's go and fetch our next sequence. And then in the operation, we're going to get on to set options. Set options is a lot of stuff that we're going to look at at future quests. But for now, we're going to go and find the, the home domain one. OK, so uh, copying over our link from glitch.me. Let's go and add that into our home domain. And you need to remove your HTTPS slash slash and your trailing slash at the end. Once you've done that, let's go sign our transaction. Add our secret key for our quest wallet. And let's go and sign in the transaction submitter. Perfect, okay, and if we now go into the Stellar Quest and we click on Verify, there you go, we've done this properly. So now we have a, um, our Quest account is attached to this domain and this Tom L file. Hope this helps.